a safety alert for anyone who drives in southwest Ohio. Yeah, there's a report out that suggests two of the most likely spots to find speeders in all of Ohio are right here in the tri-state. First area we're talking about is in Clinton County on I-71 just north of Wilmington at the 48 mile marker. The second area is I-75 in Westchester, specifically an area north of the Cincinnati, Dayton and Tylersville roads. Fox 19 Stefano DePietroAntonio joins us with more. Steph? Hey there, Dan. Well, close to 5,600 tickets handed out over a two-year period there near Wilmington. And I spent part of my day in Westchester, where tickets are being handed out for drivers who just can't seem to take their foot off the gas pedal. Just below Middletown and at milepost 20 in Westchester. Our main goal really is to slow traffic down because speed is a major contributor to fatal crashes. Troopers like Chris Williams have handed out just under 4,000 tickets from 2007 to 2009. We just try to make sure that we position ourselves obviously in a safe spot, in a visible spot. We don't want to act like we're trying to hide or anything like that. To be seen is to be safe for both drivers and troopers. Summer construction and heavy congestion means troopers are going to be busy all summer long playing that game of point, click, and ticket. William showed me how to use his laser speed detector, a very cool toy. It shoots time over distance, so it's got pulses of light that go out, and then they come back, and we see that light, and within a third of a second, we get a speed reading that's plus or minus one mile an hour. Time after time, we clocked folks way over the posted 55 miles per hour speed limit. Unfortunately, uh, citations are a part of that. This trucker, who did not want us to use his name, passes through from Michigan daily. Ever gotten a ticket here? Uh, once. Fines are doubled in construction zones, and the speeding is not just on the interstate. They fly in and out through here even. Yes, driver speed. They're crazy. Even through the rest stops. They'll run you off the road if you don't lie, if you don't know what you're doing. Lois and Mac McCool were passing through from Augusta, Georgia. When we were coming up, they were just policemen everywhere. When people warn you to stick with the speed limit, you better do it. Trooper Williams says it will do no good slamming the brakes. Once you see us, we've already got a speed reading typically. So then that just lets us know that you've hammered the brakes, we see the nose drop, and we still get a tracking history from there. So you gotta slow down. Again, troopers stress speed is the main cause of fatal crashes, other distractions like texting and also drunk driving. The ticket numbers may sound huge, but troopers say they are saving lives. Stefano DiPietro, Antonio, Fox 19 News. Thanks, Steph.